All right, what's up guys? My name is Zach and today I'm back again with more Forza and now we're actually in Forza 7. So I know I already put out a Forza video today of doing the 13B Turbo or 4 Rotor in the RX3. Now we're in Forza 7. As you can see, the graphics are totally different. The menu is totally different. You can see our RX3 parked over there in the corner. Um, so let's actually go and, well, let's take a look at it. Um, so basically I loaded up my tune so this is the same car uh performance wise as the car we had in forza 6 still the four rotor still got the little wing on the back uh should have the little chin splitter yep still has a chin splitter uh but we lost our livery or livery or however <laughs> ugh, however you say it um so that it no longer has that um, so again, I said in the last video that was posted today, uh, but I'll say it again in this video uh, If you guys want to send in a livery for the RX3, we could definitely uh, do that uh, We'll see what we get. I, I like the yellow, but I'm really down to switch colors as well. And of course I also bought Come on you guys know It looks so cool um, the wheels obviously are not spot on to my wheels. Uh, they don't have like the little bolts, but I mean, this is the closest I've ever gotten in a video game to it actually looking like my car, uh, which is really cool. And again, of course, it's the same paint code. Forza does a good job with matching paint codes and whatnot. Um, so before we get into it, uh, let's actually go back here and look at all the Mazdas that they have for sale in the game right now. So they have allegedly over 700 cars in the game uh, either unlockable or purchasable uh, as of right now and that's not including any DLC at the moment um, why am I scrolling at the slowest speed possible <laughs> so we have the 2016 Mazda MX-5 Miata um, a 2015 formula Mazda I have no idea what this is what it's from uh, or any business like that uh, there's the 2013 MX-5 Cup Miata, uh, very cool that it's uh, an open top because the rest I believe are hard top. RX-8, uh, 2011 RX-8 R3, very cool, the first rotary here on the list. The 2010 uh, number 16 Mazda Racing, lame. Uh, Mazda Speed 3, not my favorite body style. NB Miata, which is the Mazda Speed variant 2, which has weird headlight and taillight covers. Not a huge fan, but FD. So this is the first RX-7 that they have in the game. They have all three generations of RX-7, which is absolutely awesome. And if you can't tell by how fast I'm now talking, I'm super excited about it. So they have an FD. They have an NA Miata, which is always fun. And it's really cool to see it super stock uh, because I just feel like I don't see stock Miatas anymore. They have the 787B uh, in two different liveries, liveries, whatever. Um, very cool. This is my personal favorite. Um, then they have the 1991 number 62 Mazda Motorsport RX-7, which is an FC. Um, very cool. Uh, if you want to do, I might build this into an endurance race. Oh, I never noticed it says RX-7 rotary power on the door. That's really cool. But below that, we have the 1990 Savannah RX-7. So it's right-hand drive. It's the Turbo 2, essentially. Uh, well, it is a Turbo 2. You can tell by the hood, um, which is really cool. Another NA Miata? Wait, what? 94 Miata and a 90 Miata. I did not notice that they had two different NAs. I guess a convertible or a hardtop. Um, let's see. Uh, maybe this is the 1.8? How do I... 128 horsepower, 116. Yeah, that must be the 1.8 and the 1.6. Huh. Never noticed that. That's really cool, actually. Um... Of course, GSLSE uh, RX-7, the first gen, so they do have all three gens, which is really cool. Maybe doing a video with that later. I mean, it looks so cool. It's so weird seeing my car in a video game. Uh, they have the 73 RX-3, as you guys have seen on the channel. Uh, we'll be doing more with these. Very cool. And then, of course, the 1972 Mazda Cosmo 110S, uh, which is, again, very cool. So, I think we're going to get into the RX-7 app. Actually, and do a little drive. Um, 
get in. Unfortunately, I can't find a way to do test drive. Um, so we're just going to have to go to free play, I believe. All right. So here it is. Um, I guess we'll start the race, even though I think we should be the only person out on the track. Uh, look at that. I mean, it's just so cool. And the graphics in this game are so much better uh, than in any other game or any other Forza game. I mean, I'll... I'll stop it here. Look at this. I mean, this looks really cool, especially with the headlights up. I mean, it's in FB. It's really cool. Um, oh, let's go to the interior. Look at this. I mean, this is the interior. This is this is really cool. If you are going to use a wheel, like a driving wheel, um, it, it doesn't show the wheel on the screen, so it's more accurate. Which, did my headlights just go down? Oh, it doesn't show the headlights inside the car. You would totally be able to see it from this angle. But you do see it from here, which is really cool. But yeah, here it is. Uh, I'll get some isolated audio of the stock 13B. This is totally stock, uh, just because my car is, I guess, pretty close to stock GSLC. So. had a shift buzzer but this is it guys uh, i'm just showing you guys forza 7 they have i think this is the game with the most rotaries uh between all three generations of the rx7 which is new i've never had a game with that but also the rx3 uh the cosmo the 787 uh just a lot of different rotaries that you can do and of course you can rotary swap these cars to have a four rotor uh, and that sort of thing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video just showing off Forza 7. Uh, we'll probably be exclusively playing Forza 7 uh, for a little bit. I do have Car Mechanic Simulator. I plan on doing that uh, as well in the future for the Mazda products. I think they have an FD and an RX3. But I have to set up how to record that because this is the Xbox. I just record off HDMI. Um, but the computer that I use uh, is a totally different setup. So I'm going to have to figure that out um, with that. Also, if you guys are really into gaming, I do have a gaming only channel. I'll link it down below or at the end of the video. Um, I do have more gaming content and stuff other than RX-7s and stuff. I'll keep shooting cars will be just strictly rotary video games. Um, but Lambo 13, I'm doing a whole bunch of other stuff. I'm actually building an endurance Miata uh, on that channel. So check that out if you are interested in that. But again, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to rate the video, comment on the video, and subscribe if you really liked it. Take care, guys. I, I,